Welcome back to Long War 2, everybody. The Wolf Squad is ready to start Operation Lone Sleep. Rescue a VIP from Edwin Vehicle, which should finally get us our first scientist, provided we manage to defeat this mission. And then we still have this looming on the horizon supply raid, which I still fully intend to go in there without any infiltration at all. Which might be a really stupid idea, but that wouldn't stop me, right? Let's go for this one first. Advent is holding a VIP of some importance to the resistance movement, and the spokesman has asked that we intercept the transport vehicle and rescue the target. We'll have to take out any hostile forces protecting the package to secure the area. So I was just starting to get ready to uh, improvise a Bradford briefing here. And suddenly he's back and actually giving us a little bit of a briefing. We have a big squad here, seven people if I see it correctly. <coughs> so the full, I think that's uh, the full wolf squad. Everybody is currently assigned to that squad. Menace one five, we have a confirmed location for the VIP. Move to rendezvous. Eliminate all hostile contacts. Well, that's like uh, right over here. Look at, I mean, look, the map is huge. The, here's the zone wall, and all that space doesn't matter to us. We're just gonna hop down here, get the VIP, get out there. Piece of cake. <coughs> Obviously. Um, snake. Moving to position. We've got a hostile squad here. Now, that's obviously not so cake like. But we can set up some. Do I really want to engage two groups at once? I don't wanna, but can I? How picky can I be here? Oh, they're close enough to block this. That's not nice. I mean, I could move everyone to the left. To engage these guys first. Running. Problem is, that's only that. That was our only um, cover spot. <coughs> On my way. Hmm. No time like the present. Steady weapon. Auto Watch. You need to be in a good position if you had two shots. Understood. Moving out. Eyes on the prize. You know, to get a better, okay, better view here. Let's get down there. Victor should also be in a good position. Together, we are strong. And good old Ross. Well, that seems a bit um, too enthusiastic. No, my luck, there's like a civilian just standing there waiting for me to jump down. So. Why don't we <coughs> stay like this? That's pretty much perfect. Choo choo, go away. Huh. 
That's weird. So an explosion from this thing would still damage the officer? No. Nah. Not gonna take it though. You're gonna... Overwatch. You will overwatch. You will... A big question here. Okay. One of you, whoever has the higher aim. Okay, that's just stupid what I'm doing here. We've got 84. Tank. We've got 82. So then you will overwatch. Keeping this shot as a reserve. Uh, making sure that it. Yeah, okay, I don't see those guys. And then. We start off. We have a really good chance of taking this guy out. We could take a guaranteed kill on one of the others, but I feel like this is worth it. And of course we don't roll a crit. Magic word here. Where to? That's a good question. Where to? Got the plate safe. Moving to designated coordinates. It is destined. Be on your guard. I kinda want to get you in a position where you might be able to flank something next turn. Because you have awesome movement. In the service of Ayer. Interesting. Are you telling me they are not. they didn't activate yet? He's taking cover, so it feels like a, 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 it's active already. You can get, take a 100% shot against the Viper. Not the best crit chance, though. Now what I'm doing here is a bit risky. I'm, I'm moving up and setting up an overwatch trap. The problem of that is the, the whole reflex action thing. Seems doable. So they could take some shots at my guys. Got it covered. No time like the present. Back in! Overwatch! Considering this great position though, I feel like it's worth it. Let's move you back here. Hold this point. To move you like here ish. I'm actually tempted to even move him up on the roof. Trust me. Yeah, actually, let's do that. There we go. Shot wide. 
might not have been worth it, considering these horrible shots. So yeah, he's the problem. Um, and also the timer is the problem. 88. That, that, um, what's it called? Steady weapon, 25%. That's amazing. And it's death from above. Which means, take another shot here. That's what you call easy cleanup. from the turn timer. This duty is mine. Dawn will come. Ready to go. Overwatch. Just gonna take some reloads. Some Reload overwatch. No problem. Double check the hack. Well, okay, that's the VIP door. We won't, don't want to do that yet. Uh, jammed. No, no idea. Come get some. Actually, this time you can stay here. On Overwatch. So be it. As was foreseen. Nothing. Okay, then we open up. Let him have it. Triple Viper. Yes. I hope they work out. So idea one is run it down. I will find a way. Hi. Well <clears throat> that idea already didn't go as planned. But we've got plan B. This might be useful. Okay, so far so good. Cannot get to a flanking position against that stun lancer, that's not very nice. How about we hail of bullets this thing? is obviously to command here to take a shot. No, I should probably should have used focus fire. 
And really, the downside is that command ends my turn. So I'm not really sure what the best... If I could have played this better. Okay, so you need to flashbang them. No problem, boss. Okay, you're telling me I can't command my soldier back there. Probably because I don't have line of sight because of this pillar. Instead of using command, I could also just go for a flash. Orders confirmed. Moving out. I think it's command and shotgun is the more reliable option here. Bit concerned that this stun lancer might be able to move here and attack me. Okay. 24, fire. still... Really decent shots. Yeah, guys. Um, haven't the whole used this one in a while, huh? The VIP in tow. Proceed to the extraction point. Um, guys. Oh, you just runs out. It's like, yeah, it's it's locked, and you know you need to hack it, but no biggie. Okay, we still want to hack it for the. I'll take a look. I don't know resistance watch list. Okay, I think the first thing is free rebel. And this is reduced contact cost. I'm trying for this one. Well. Wow. No comment. Yeah, like you couldn't fail that. Heading out. Got a free reload. Speak boldly. On the move. That seems like the rest of the map is clear. Our path is clear. Yeah, take cover next to this exploring thing. We must stand as one. What? Just open the door. What kind of scientist are you? Will do. It's probably a faceless. Slay our target before it is too late. Okay, we've got reinforcements incoming. And we obviously don't know where. Let's get the VIP to safety. We get high ground? No, not really. Moving to position. Well, 
Actually, he could have. It's a bit awkward here. I'm going. Come get some. I want you on higher ground. Or I want you with a steadied weapon. Yeah, that works for me. Sure thing. So uh, reinforcements do not get these reflex actions, so you can stand out in the open and take a shot. Idea where they don't drop. Oh, they don't drop at all. They just pour in. Nope. Okay. That's four of them. Concerning here. Okay, we've got a. Can take a shotgun shot on one of those guys. Can probably melee one of them. 92 isn't too bad. Yeah, let's start off with that. That was weird. Okay, I mean, we studied weapon. Let's make it worth it. 65, 68, uh, 68. Ooh. Take him down, and I think the snake shouldn't be a problem here. Whatever you say. Ah, uh, let's take the shotty. Impressed yet? And that's that. Okay, what was this again? Precision. Let's what this guy's signals. Okay, sometimes it's a resource catch or supplies, intel, stuff like that. Then it's worth to hack it. This is Firebrand. VIP is secure. Enforcements, so I think we should. Well, not, not getting out this turn. Maybe not even the next. I'm waiting on you. Heading out. No problem, boss. Running. No need to rush this here. Go, go, go! Ready to go! We must stand as one. No further reinforcements. Can we make it out this turn? We can. I'm on my way. Can we? Yes, we can. Copy that! Uh, yeah, we can read. No need to ask twice. Good. I'm gone. I'm going. Stepping off. Well, that's a flawless mission. I've ever saw What's one. Over there? May honor guide us. Indeed. Three turns to spare. Packing it in. Until. Let's go. 
smooth. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. I've never seen um, such a great spawn position. Like the start position was basically in line of sight of the VIP. And then just a hop, skip and a jump to the VEC point. Easy peasy. Let's see if we get some promotions out of this. That would be really nice. If every mission goes this smoothly, it's only a matter of time before we regain control of the planet. Okay, we've got a corporal here. And I think locked on. I mean, I like the pump action, but it's so situational, and this will will help. Now, here's where things get interesting. Actual now is a bonus to hit, plus twenty to hit. That's pretty good. But the way, the aggressive way we've been playing here. So I'm suspecting if I run and gun into a trench gun position. Ooh, baby, yes. Not even going to finish that thought. No promotion here. We got a scientist. Definitely know who gets the death perception thing. So we can get some alloys. That's nice. What's the time on this one? Two day is eight hours. <coughs> and this is what? One day, ten hours. If we really go in here with zero preparation. Just wanna let us see the thing. Yeah, if we take a full squad, then this will have literally no effect. Like, total infiltration time will be at something like 10 days, so even spending a day on infiltration will not have any meaningful effect. So I want to start thinking about what I want to take on this mission. What kind of soldiers. And um, assault by class. It's going to be at least... Yeah, I want two sharpshooters. So I, I want to wait for Connor to be back. I probably want at least two technicals. So I need to wait for Shannon to get back. And then probably like some grenadiers, some gunners, some rangers and a good shinobi or two. Maybe... Uh, probably have to bring Ross, right? Or sergeant. Does him reaching sergeant allow us to activate anything? Not really. Yeah, Vulture wasn't available before. But 150 supplies? Yeah, probably not gonna happen. So let's... Um, Let's scan and then do this extraction, and after that we go for the big mission. I do not think I could have predicted this outcome, though it is intriguing. It is indeed. You know what else is intriguing? I foresee a number of valuable applications stemming from this technology. 
I'll have a report assembled as soon as the research is complete. Okay. Um, we are gonna scan the last 14 hours here. On the 11. Yeah, that's fine. Because now it's vulnerable. I'm not sure why it takes a little bit more than 100% to get to vulnerable. All right, um, Operation Twisted Skies. Hopefully another engineer, hopefully all our troops get out of there with um, without any injuries so we can send the best we have against the supply raid. Which will be, well, Twisted Skies will be in the next episode and the supply raid in the episode after that. Thanks for watching. See you next time.